Joshua, chapter 16. The lot that fell to the Josephites extended from the Jordan at Jericho to the waters of Jericho, east of the wilderness. Then the boundary went up from Jericho to the heights at Bethel. Leaving Bethel for Luz, it crossed the ridge to the border of the Archites at Ataroth, and descended westward to the border of the Japhletites, to that of the lower Beth Horon, and to Gezer, from there to the sea. Within the heritage of Manasseh and Ephraim, sons of Joseph, the dividing line for the heritage of the Ephraimites by their clans ran east from Ataroth Adar to Upper Beth Horon, and thence to the sea. From Michmathoth on the north, their boundary curved eastward around Ta'anoth Shiloh, and continued east of it to Genoa. From there it descended to Adaroth and Naara, and reaching Jericho, it ended at the Jordan. From Tapua, the boundary ran westward to the Wadi Kana, and ended at the sea. This was the heritage of the Ephraimites by their clans, including the villages that belonged to each city set aside for the Ephraimites within the heritage of the Manassites. But they did not dispossess the Canaanites living in Gezer. They live within Ephraim to the present day, though they have been put to forced labor.